hello guys how is it going so in this video I want to share to you about the plugin Elementor S website design tool so I have many students ask me do I need to upgrade my free version Elementor to pro version in order to create stunning website so let me answer you this question by showing you the website that I'm having right now so first of all, you have a very nice homepage with the particle background effects, stunning entrance animations, creative buttons, very nice background videos and stuff. You got a very nice profile with the hover animations and the social networks. And you have very nice complete personal block list. How about the other website that I'm having, which is Internet of Me. You have the numbers over here you have animated text and what I like about these features is that you can choose each category based on your YouTube videos and you can just click on it and watch the video with a nice pop-up so people can watch the video comfortably and also very nice call to action sections and social feeds and this is marketing of me you have very nice flick box with anchor navigation you have the flick box image, you have the timeline story basically telling your adventure or journey and also very nice background videos and the accordion and you also can promote your products online so let me tell you one thing the website and these web pages that you are looking right now are purely created by free version Elementor with its add-on plugins so what do you mean by add-on plugins? So when you are at your Elementor design interface, if you're having a free version, basically you have the basic tab, the general tab, and the WordPress tab. So these tabs will provide you basic elements so you can just click, drag and drop, and then just put in the contents. While with add-on plugins, the add-on plugins will provide you extra features that can enhance your website presentation and illustrations like those features that I've just shown to you guys. So far at this current moment I recommend three add-on plugins that are well compatible and up to the date which are the first one Elementor add-on elements, the essential add-ons and the premium add-ons. These add-on plugins have provided a lot of extra feature and element that can help you to improve your website presentations so there are tons of elements that they have provided for you so which elements are suitable if you want to know more on which elements that I have used and apply onto my website on these web pages there is an article in the video description below just click on it the article will basically tell you what are the suitable elements that you can use. So if you're having a WordPress website and you're also using Elementor, I highly recommend you guys to install and activate these three add-on plugins. The best thing is that they are free to use. They have free version, of course they have the upgrade versions. So by using this free version Elementor plugin and those add-on plugins I can create amazing website without any problem so does it worth to go for pro version I think you got the answer right so that's not all I also want to show you guys the plugins and those add-on plugins will help you to optimize your page in different screen sizes which are desktop tablets and mobile so I'm going to show to you an example which is this one the page I'm having right now you have animated tags and you have very nice icons over here and the timeline offer let's try to look at this page in different screen size what I usually do I'll just bring this tab up into a new window and I'm going to put this thing reduce the browser until it looks like a mobile screen size around that figure and just have a look on how responsive it is with those elements so if I try to increase the browser tab so it will be like a tablet you can see it becomes responsive with the video background playing so if I reduce it it will change to another presentations which is very responsive 
including the headline as well. If I try to increase a bit, you can see the icons, they have switched the position to the site. So if I reduce it a little bit, it will be a different presentation. And of course, in the desktop mode, it looks absolutely amazing, especially with those background particles effect, which is very, very cool. So if you're interested to learn how to use Elementor plugin to create your own unique website without any WordPress team, I can teach you how to do it with zero cost. There is an online course that I've just published and I want to show to you guys which is DIY website to build website from scratch with Elementor plugins. If you try to look at the sections below on the courses structures, I basically will teach you how to create one home page, another one professional sub page, and another one social sub page so they can form together and present themselves as a website. That's not all, I will also teach you how to create pop ups, promotion header, easy banner, contact form with button trigger, and also you can import my page templates. And at the last sections, from time to time, I will upload more videos covering most of the relevant elements that you can use to improve further on your website presentation and illustration. So the best thing is that I'm running an offer right now because I'm giving out free coupons for this course and it is time limited. If you want to enroll into this course, please go to the video description below. There is a link for you to click on it and you can redeem this free coupons. So if you're not interested, it's totally fine because at the end of the day, I just want to tell you guys, Elementor plugin is very, very amazing. Even with its free version and the add-on plugins that I have recommended to you, I'm going to say that again because they are very important. Elementor add-on, essential add-ons and premium add-ons. Please install and activate them and you will see how amazing they are check out their extra elements or features that they have provided for you it's going to blow your mind and from now on everyone can create stunning website without knowing any coding languages isn't that amazing